everyone. Good morning. It is 9:10, and we are at the surgical center waiting for Mozzie to get blood work for his liver. And for Miggy here, <laughs> we got two doggies here today and Miggy to get his um, bladder rechecked. Um, they wanted him to have it rechecked after a month. Um, after when they were going to do surgery and then they didn't do surgery. Well, they want him to have it rechecked after a month just to double check that everything is going okay. So, and these two, every time someone comes out the door is like, no, mom, don't let them be for me. <laughs> don't let them take me. Right, Mozzie? <laughs> He's watching. Okay, guys, we'll be back after, um, they get all checked over. I don't know if I'll know Mozzie's blood results um, today because um, I'm not sure if they got to send them out. I don't know what kind of blood work they're doing today. So um, so I may have to update you on him after I find that out. So are you see, do you see them back there, Miggy? Do you see them back there? I couldn't let them pee this morning either um, just in case they have to do urine tests. So they're probably, their bladders are <laughs> probably full and saying, let me out to go pee pee. <laughs> All right, guys, we'll be back. All right, we're back from the vet. Um, look at all these leaves, guys. They're pretty nice red leaves, but <laughs> it's making it a little bit harder to find the dog poops, find the landmines. Yes. <laughs> oh, Mickey, you squished the ball too much. I couldn't kick it. I couldn't kick it very well. There we go. <laughs> it's a little chillier out today. Um, it's very, it's overcast and it was misting a little bit when we were at the vet, but I wanted to tell you guys the good news. Miggy, Mig, hey Miggy, you wanna tell him? Do you wanna tell him Miggy? Miggy had his ultrasound done on his bladder and there is nothing in it. So any struvite, if that's how you pronounce it, struvite crystals that were in there, they're all gone. His bladder is clear. So, um, the food, the Royal Canaan urinary SO moderate calorie dog foodies eating, it's doing its job. And we've also been given the boys, um, filtered water now. Um, our zero water thing that sits on my island in the kitchen. I'll show it to you when we go in because I want to show you a couple of the dog treats um, that I found. I found that um, my boys really like and they have no problems with that are low fat. I wanted to share those with you too. So yes, we've been giving all the dogs filtered water now, and and then Miggy with just eating his urinary uh, special prescription food. He's his bladder. Is completely clear so I'm so happy um, Mozzie had uh, blood work done in a uh, urine sample taken because they haven't done a urine sample in a while so they did a flood flood <laughs> a full blood panel so they have to send that out so I'm gonna have to wait um, probably a day or two to find out the results of that so um, I'll have to let you guys know in a video when we get that when we get those results back hopefully that's all still going good so um so all we've got scheduled so far on the calendar for this rest of this year is grant who's over here who's been doing good um got to get his toe hopefully just that toe is affected um they do have to do a ct scan before the surgery Hopefully he'll just have to get that toe amputated and then he'll be good. Um, and that's November 3rd. Um, I asked today when I was there if there's been any cancellations. Sadly, no. I'm going to call every couple days and they're probably going to get sick of me. But I'm going to call every couple days to see um, if anyone's canceled. So maybe I can get him in sooner than November 3rd. Um, I guess there's a... Um, vet shortage here in Michigan um, a lot of veterinary offices are short vets so 
that's why one of the reasons besides everything with COVID, one of the reasons why um, appointments are so much further out. So, um, so anyways, I'm going to call every couple days and see, maybe I'll get lucky and there'll be a cancellation. We can get them in sooner. And then the only other vet appointment I have is for Miggy. Um, he's getting his teeth cleaned October 27th. So hopefully, fingers crossed, those are our only other two big vet appointments here for the rest of the year. Um, oh, I, I hope, I hope. And hopefully everything goes well with Brant recovering with his toe. People have messaged me, uh, sent me emails saying that their dog had to have a toe amputated. And um, after a couple of weeks, it was like, it didn't even matter if they had that toe or not. They were getting around great. So I pray that that's what happens with Mr. Grant, that he recovers really good from it. Um, so, <laughs> he's twitching his eyes, waiting for me to kick this ball. He's like, shut up and kick the ball. <laughs> All right, let me go in and show you those treats. All right, excuse my dishwasher in the background. <laughs> I had to start my dishes. It was pretty full. I couldn't finagle things to where I could fit more in it. So I had to run it. So here's the zero water um, filtration system we have. We just leave it sitting right here on our island. And I always have plastic cups, which I got to get more. Um, so people can grab some ice water. Um, well, it's not ice water in there, but ice out of the freezer and then get some water. Um, or fill up their... Um, uh, Yetis or whatever kind of tumbler they have, they can get some water. I'm filling it up right now. That's why that pitcher's sitting there. Because I just uh, cleaned the dog bowls out and put fresh water outside and inside. So they are now getting filtered water. So hopefully that's obviously helping Miggy because his crystals are gone in his bladder. And hopefully um, if anybody else is getting them, it'll be helping them too. So, um, so I will link that in our... Amazon store down below. I don't know if I did it last time I shared it. So here are the dog treats that I've been buying. Um, I can sometimes, like this one here, I found at um, Home Goods. Um, I don't get there often because that's like a 40 minute drive away. Found those at Home Goods and then I found these ones at TJ Maxx. They're cheaper if you can find them at TJ Maxx or Home Goods than they are on Amazon or Chewy.com. I think this was either, let me see, oh, um, $7.99 and online, I think the cheapest I found them on Amazon was like $15 for this bag. <laughs> so um, if you can shop at a, if you can find a TJ Maxx or a Home Goods around you, try to find these sweet potato treats there because they will be cheaper. Sweet potato treats are going to be, at least from what I found, from all the treats I've looked at, and of course I haven't seen all treats, um, they're going to be the lowest in fat if you're trying to keep your dog on a low-fat diet, which schnauzers kind of really need to be um, not extremely low-fat, I guess, if your dog's never had a pancre pancreatic problems, but um, if they've ever had a pancre uh, pancreatitis attack, They've got to be on low fat. So I keep all my dogs on a lower fat diet, especially Mozzie, um, who had a pancreatitis, pancreatitis attack um, just a short while ago this year. And then Max had one when he was about three, four years old. I can't remember um, exactly when his was. Maybe he was two. I can't remember offhand. So those two have had one. So they eat a low fat diet. So I wanted to share um, these treats that I've been buying for my boys. Um, so these ones, these three right here are all by California Prime. Uh, they're made in the USA. These are called Sweet Tater Bones and the Minimum Low Fat, which I know it's the minimum and they don't share the, um, the max, but the minimum is zero. And so the max isn't going to be that much, <laughs> maybe 2%. So these are really good. My dogs really like those. Um, they're kind of a chewy treat too. So they kind of get the gums and stuff and the teeth for cleaning. 
Um, these ones here are called uh, chicken and sweet tater bone wraps. So they're basically like these, but with a um, piece of chicken wrapped around it. Chicken, chicken flavored. I don't know if it's actually a piece of chicken. But these are made in the USA. Like I said, the minimum on this is one. So the high is going to be maybe 2% higher, like I said. That's what I've noticed from looking at labels. Um, these ones are chicken wrapped sweet tater sticks. So the minimum on this is also one. And these I usually cut in half. I can make a little slit and then and bend them and cut them in half. So they're not even getting that full percent, percent of fat because I cut them in half. So Because if you notice, some of these bags are pretty small. You don't get very many in them. So um, for seven dogs, I've got to make them last. So those sticks I cut in half. Um, this one here is also made in the USA, U.S. Farmers. Um, I don't know. It's called Wholesome Pride. So these are like dehydrated sweet potatoes. And these, um, the minimum fat is, oh, trying to find it, 0.5%. So these are really good too. And like I said, none of my dogs have had any problems um, getting sick or anything when eating them. Um, they digest them really good and I've had no problems with them. So, And then this one here is by Blue Ridge Naturals. Sweet Tater Jerky Sticks, made in the USA. Um, let's see what the, 0% minimum fat. So um, so I just wanted to share these treats with you guys. I will try to find them all um, on Amazon if I can um, and link them down in our Amazon store in the description below this video. I'm also going to find the stick that the boys were playing with in the video yesterday because a lot of people were asking me what it was called. We got it from a sweet subscriber who sent it to the boys and they just love it. Um, especially Milo, Magnum, and Miggy. They love that toy. So I'm going to link that in the Amazon store too. I should have done it yesterday, but I wasn't even thinking about it. So I'm not good at that, guys. I'm not good at that at all. <laughs> Sharing links. So I'm going to link all these treats if I can and link that stick for you. So, all right guys, I hope everybody's having a great day and um, we'll talk to you again in the next video. Bye-bye.